to toss things over now to our very own Matt Whitcoast. Believe it or not, we actually got to visit Ottawa County where West Michigan's first public observatory was located. Matt? That's right, Haley. There is a public observatory in Ottawa County. A group called the Shoreline Amateur Astronomical Association is having a big event there Monday. It's bringing out a special telescope. Members tell me the experience is going to be out of this world. The new Hemlock Observatory is a new addition to the Ottawa County Parks and it's open to the public. We learned about our world by studying the sky. It's safe to say Peter Berkey with the Shoreline Amateur Astronomical Association loves outer space. I can tell my experience is um, it's kind of a mind altering event because it is something that you've never seen anything like it. Berkey is, of course, talking about the total solar eclipse. I just really encourage everybody, no matter what you're doing, just stop around three o'clock and you'll notice things getting a little, uh, a little more dim around here. As the sky dims, his astronomy group will be using a special telescope to look skyward. Filters out all the light except that one given by the hydrogen gas. And that allows you to see things you normally cannot see. These two have seen several total solar eclipses. I think it's an event and an experience that anybody should experience at least once in their lifetime. Even if it isn't a full solar eclipse. Uh, once you do it, you say, you're right, Frank. That was amazing. and I'll never forget it. Now, they're looking to make new memories shared with others. I'm getting old. Pete's getting old. The eyes are going bad. We need replacements. <laughs> That's their mission, educating the next generation. We feel that we need to get astronomy out to the general public, especially youth. The Shoreline Amateur Astronomical Association's event starts at 1 on Monday and will go during the duration of the eclipse. They also hold public outings at the Hemlock Observatory every Friday with weather dependent. Reporting in studio, I'm Matt Whitkos, Fox 17 News.